Hey everyone, welcome back to Ebony with Genghis, Parts Unknown. Just going over a few things today. Uh, there was a brief update last night and then Ebony took it away. I think it was only available for a couple hours. Not sure if anybody saw it, but uh, a few days ago I did an update on uh, Alliance Science tab had skills so you could do temporary skills where you would improve your alliance for 10 minutes it was things like double drop or uh, attacking archer skill and it would only last for 10 minutes things like that but last night ebony did a update night for me uh right around uh, zero zero server time it, w it had to do with bookmarks so if you would go to see a boss, you would see a bookmark right above there, and it was for an alliance. And then if you went to add bookmark, you could choose to add it to the alliance tab or your own. You could look on here, and there was a little button in this area that said alliance bookmarks. So in theory, you would not have to share monsters in the alliance tab so you wouldn't have to go here and share monsters you would you could just go to the bookmarks and see what it was available i managed to take a screenshot of it this is what it looked like you could see the alliance bookmark area and you could choose to do that i did not take a screenshot of the second part where you actually go and see the alliance bookmarks because I just didn't think that uh, Ebony would delete it like that. <laughs> I thought it was going to be live and I could talk about it today. But uh, anyways, it's gone. I think this is a good update. It was annoying the place where it was. I kept hitting Alliance bookmarks instead of attack whenever I was trying to set a rally. But uh, anyways, I guess it's just something you'd get used to. But the bad news was you could only bookmark five things for your Alliance. So I guess maybe that would be good for... Uh, battlefield you want to bookmark a couple things or SVS maybe you could bookmark a couple Alliance hives uh, every SVS weekend but in terms of bosses only five at a time so I think they got to up that up it to I don't know at least like 25 50 something reasonable so anyone on your Alliance could hop online see the monsters rally them they don't got to scroll up and then just delete once you uh, delete once you uh, set the monster. So anyways, uh, the other update, this one, I don't, I don't know how I feel about it, if I care. Uh, some of you might have seen on the Misers video, he actually told me about this a few days ago. Uh, App Gallery, Huawei, Huawei, however you want to pronounce it, is no longer affiliated with Ebony. I actually told them, so Huawei, uh, for their promotions, they would pay YouTubers, give us some sort of incent small incentive, it wasn't too much, to make a video for the monthly. I actually told them two months ago I was done, I wasn't making any more videos. Uh, I just, uh, you know, I, I didn't like some of the, they wanted too much uh, editing rights and uh, they'd constantly make me reshoot the video. It wasn't anything wrong with what they wanted. Just for me, my setup, uh, it's annoying for me to go on BlueStacks, go on my computer, film, and then edit, and then reshoot things for them. So I just said no, I didn't want to do any more. It had nothing to do with the promotions. I thought their promotions were fine. Uh, sometimes they were really good. Sometimes, you know, when they had that 30% cash back promotion, that was awesome that you really saved money. And like Miser said, especially for people in foreign currencies, like uh, I know it really helped me as a Canadian when I was coining, because our packs, uh, we get some sort of weird extra tax on our packs. Uh, I think it's a, someone told me it was a Facebook tax and that's why. So anyways, if I go to purchase something here, $6.99, that's the $5 pack. It, uh, so our $100 pack would come up as $139 on here. Let's see if I could actually see that. I think I can if I go to Trial of Knights and show you. Uh, any, yes, right here. So $139. On my credit card, that'll say $169 because all the taxes. 
So Huawei would be a way, App Gallery had a way that it would kind of bring that down. I'd only be paying like 110. But then I stopped coining anyway, so it didn't really matter. But I, I do have some points left. I looked, I have about $35 in points added up from a long time ago that I never used. So I guess I'll use those, spend them up uh, so that they don't expire or take them away. But no one knows if, if uh, Ebony's still going to offer the percentage like uh, I looked just today and it said 13% for this event uh, in points. It used to be 10 or 25, different things like that. No one knows if that's still going to be offered or not. But the coupons that they offered where it was like if you buy X amount of 100 packs, you get this many seashells and you could do this with it. Uh, that stuff's gone. App Gallery is no longer doing anything else for Ebony. And the reason behind it is because... Ebony told everybody, I'm sure, remember when Ebony was taken out of the app store? I think it was probably because they were giving different discounts to different uh, medians of payment. So Play Store, App Gallery, and uh, App Store, Apple Store. Uh, anyways, obviously they were giving the Chinese store the better discount. That's probably why iTunes, Apple was upset and took them down and slapped their hand and now everything's equal and now Huawei can't give those discounts so now they're going to be discontinued. So I really don't think this is, Ebony can do anything about this. I actually think this is uh, Apple using the monopoly that they have and uh, Google as well basically threatening to take their game offline. So it's either make some money or make no money for Ebony's decision, for top games decision so anyways it's gone go into your app store use all your points because we don't know what's going to happen with them we don't know if they're going to disappear uh, use them on another game if you don't want to support ebony but i would definitely look at getting rid of those points so those are the two updates today i hope everybody has fun in svs good luck in svs and uh, i'll probably do some live streaming that's one of the reasons why i wanted to uh, come to this server and work with the other guy was that I could actually live stream in SVS and it won't just be a live stream of me behind a bubble or on fire. So let's see how that goes if I get some time. So anyways, Genghis, parts unknown, like, subscribe, leave a comment.